Hi! Oh, it's cold! <laughs> Hi, this is Maria from Maria's Garden in Punta Gorda, Florida. Guess what? I have a secret. And the secret is going to be revealed right now. You don't believe what happened. But since I share everything with you, I like to share this. This gray marrow is pink. You see, that's beautiful. It's going to have a lot, a lot of beautiful flowers. About maybe four weeks ago, I had problem. Full of black mold. You cannot see the green was black. Everything was black. And this usually happens a lot in this area. I don't know why. The humidity or something. I think it has to do something with the humidity in this area because up north, where my brother-in-law lives up, up um, in Georgia, they have beautiful gray mares and they don't have problems. But over here, was infested with a black mold that you touch him. Anyway, I try everything. I try soap, I try all kinds of different things to clean it. I clean leaf by leaf, then come out many, many times. So anyway, I'm looking at it and I say, my God, she cannot breathe, just black mold. So I say, Lucas, come and help me. The guy that does my videos, look. That's me. That's him. Anyway, and I say, let's bring the horse and let's do something. So what I did, you don't believe it. My God, I got my bleach. And this is four weeks ago. I got this, okay? Because I was devastated. The plant cannot breathe like that. Well, the black stuff. I spray everything. I mean, I spray everything. I spray the whole plant. I spray everything. And I wait like five minutes. And then I got a hose with cold water and I rinse it like 45 minutes after that. Make sure there wasn't any bleach there, would go down. Make sure the plant don't have time to, to take any bleach. And this is the plant now clean, super clean. Look at this. The, my plant is clean. No more, blow, no more black mold and the plant is breathing, it's happy. I just wanna share with this with you. I'm not telling you to use this and the plants at all because each plant is different, okay? You might put this and your plant might die, one, two, three, you know what I mean? Uh, but I'm just telling you, this is what happened, and Lucas helped me, he can tell you about it. Yes, I actually witnessed her spray the whole thing with bleach and then rinse it off in about five minutes later, and the plant now is spotless. It's spotless and can breathe, but that's what I did, because I don't know what else to do. Uh, I don't like the plants full of mold, and uh, I want it healthy. So look at my baby. Ah! My baby is happy now. My baby is happy. Oh, here is a leaf. This is how, uh, maybe one leaf. Look at this. This is how it was. And I tried anything to take it out, this black stuff. But look at now, it's clean, 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 clean. And I'm so happy. I just um, telling you, don't ever give up in your plants. If they get sick, you gotta take care of them. You gotta do something about it. Clean it with soapy water. Um, watch them with the hose. Get a little rug and clean them. Uh, to, to, I mean to take care of them and the plants be good to your plants and your plants be good to you with these beautiful flowers you see the color over here this is the color you see that it's a beautiful what so um, you can say this baby was sick and I just keep an eye on all my plants but anyway uh, thank you for watching but don't use this in your plants I just telling you work in my plant and I'm happy until next time from Maria's Garden. Thank you for watching. Please call me. You have a question. 941-457-1172. That's my cell phone number. I can help with questions. Doesn't mean I know everything, but I know a little bit about plants. And uh, I'm very, very pleased. The results of my uh, nursery. My nursery is doing healthy, clean, nice. I don't have problems. Uh, I keep an eye on my plants, I really do. I really keep an eye on everything. I mean, if I see something that is looking not good, needs soil, needs fertilizer, is sick, I take it to the hospital, one, two, three, and take care of that problem. So maybe that's why uh, my plants are good. Also, I got two more Madagascar palms from that lady that's moving, and I gotta replant them. And, and thanks God, I'm gonna save it. I'm very happy about it. And for all those new people, I'm Maria from Maria's Garden, and I start doing videos when I start my nursery. 
a lot of people were not familiar with the Desert Rosas and they asked me many many questions all day Can customers come and ask me questions and questions and questions so i said one day well i'm gonna make a video that way they can watch you how to plant them they can watch you how to take water in them and that's how i start the channel and now i have a lot of a lot of videos and and uh, of course i know three times more than i used to know but i don't know everything bye bye until next time love everybody